Hey guys, this is Ken in Orlando. I'm here using the mobile phone. I just pulled up at the Circle K gas station, so let's just do a quick check of the sign here. The price is $4.09 for regular and $5.09 for premium. When we get over to the gas pump, we're actually going to use premium for this test. And the reason is I want to show people that use premium as a requirement for their car, how much it's actually going to cost me to fill up my car with premium. And then we're going to test the results and see exactly what type of what type of results I get using a premium gasoline. So this way I have a, a demonstration for people that like can see how much money they're gonna save if you drive a car, such as like a foreign car or something with the premium engine that you know the manufacturer says you should use nothing but the highest grade gasoline. So I'm back in the car and I'm gonna put this camera over here and show you how close I am to empty. And last night I went on a quick drive to another part of town that was about 25 miles away, uh, 20 miles, well 25 miles away, it was about a 50 mile round trip. And um, by the time I got home, the car told me I was doing 19 miles per gallon average, right? But when I was on the highway, it was like 20, 21. So let's get this down here. Okay, so you can pretty much see how low the, the needle is on E. So from every test that I do, since I, I don't want to go too crazy and damage my car or run out of gas, every time that I'm going to stop my trip, I'm going to stop the trip once the needle gets right, right uh, super attached at like the, the point of the line where the letter E is. Normally I can drive my car past that point a little bit lower before it actually really gets real, real low. But since we're going to do something in order to uh, register what the proper amount of gasoline is left for every single test run that we do, we're gonna stop every single test run at the line right there. Now also you see this right here, it says reset. So like I said, you see the car, it even went from 19.1 miles per gallon to 19 miles per gallon because I'm just sitting here at idle. But when we start driving later, we're gonna press the reset button and then we're going to start driving. So it's gonna actually start calculating a fresh new calculation once we hit the road, all right? Uh, one last thing before we go put gas, we're gonna go over to the right side of the dashboard and see what the actual mileage is. So as you watch this video and we get from the first two to three videos through this series of testing to see how this stuff works and compares uh, without the Fuel Factor X and with the Fuel Factor X, the starting mileage here is 167,316 miles. With that being said, let's go ahead, let's pull up to the pump and let's get some gas in. Let's fill it up with premium and see how much that costs.